Hi there, Eric Chappelle, InfraWorks 360 Community Evangelist, and I'd like to show you a quick tip on the imagery provided by Model Builder. Not sure if you knew this, but you can actually control the quality of this imagery and, and get a little better result than what you get by default when you build a model using Model Builder. Once you've built the model, if you want to increase the quality of the imagery, you need to open the Data Sources panel and find the, the line item that represents the imagery for your model. Now what I've done is I've already boosted this up. So if I right click imagery here and go to configure, on the data source configuration dialog on the raster tab, you'll see that the tile level here is set to 19, a ground resolution of 0.2986 meters per pixel. The default resolution that came in was number 17, which you can see is quite a bit larger, over one meter per pixel. So I bumped it up to this. Now, when you bump up the imagery to this level, it does take a considerable amount of time to download that higher resolution imagery. So nothing comes without a price, but the result that you get is much crisper. So a quick way for me to show you the difference is to roll this back to level 17, which is what I got the first time or as a default with Model Builder. And if you keep your eye on the markings on these athletic fields here, you'll see the difference in the quality when I hit close and refresh. So remember, we're bumping back now from the highest resolution available, which is that level 19, um, back to 17, which is what happened when I created the model with the default settings. And you can see that the resolution of the imagery is much uh, much less clear, much lower quality than I see with the level 19 imagery. So again, this is how you would typically bring it in. This is how it would, would look by default. And you would go right click the data source and to configure, raster tab, and then go to this tile level setting under Bing Maps, scroll down and pick you know, a higher quality resolution. Uh, it goes as high as 19 in this case and uh, that's how you can boost up the quality of your aerial imagery. So I hope you enjoyed this tip, hope you found it useful, and uh, have a great day.